Hi, I'll just take uh, the BTS meal, please. Do you want the sauces to come with that? Yes, please. And I'll just do a regular Coke with that, and that'll be it. Okay, your total's going to be 820 at your first window. Awesome, thank you. Hey, everyone, welcome to an episode of Fast Talk Show. It's fast food talking faster about it. Hey, you tell, I'm at McDonald's, so it's probably going to be a McDonald's review. No, it's Burger King food. It's like, I'm joking. It's, it's a McDonald's review. If you see a restaurant in the background in any of my videos, more than likely I am reviewing that item. I don't know what I'm doing here. But. Oh my goodness. Making a mess already. But. McDonald's. In 2020. Did. These weird like musician combo meals. They did one for J Bone and they did one for uh, Travis Scott. Both I've reviewed. Both of us I've said how I hate that idea. How dumb it sounds. And how like a dumb idea. Like how it does nothing. How it doesn't give you new, anything new. All that jazz. Uh, and now they're doing the BTS meal. You don't know who BTS is. They're a Korean, a Korean K-pop group. I don't know how many there are. They didn't give me a straw. No, they did. Okay. But it from Korea. I don't know any of their names. Even though I've been seeing them all over Instagram just because McDonald's. Then it hit me. How a genius idea that is. Because before I I, I like I think I gave like a breakdown of how to, how to correctly promote. And someone might want to watch that video. McDonald's watched that video. Or just had the idea. And it, they finally. It worked. It finally clicked with people. Or with me. How kind of a genius idea this is. But. You have BTS, a Korean pop band. They're like number one in Korea. You have all these brand deals and everything. And all that jazz. How do you say you bring it over to America? America, people will start to really like, like the K-pop stuff. That cook tastes weird. Like how much of a genius idea that is. That you kind of self-promote yourself themselves in a way. They're promoting McDonald's, the number one fast food chain in the world. Like how much that works. So they did. The the BTS meal. And I'm gonna say I was wrong. Like it's a genius idea. It's self promotion. It's we bring two things that Koreans like. Oh, well, hmm. I mean, how do I word that? It's two things that are really popular in Korea, and it's K-pop and BTS and McDonald's. Like I don't know. I don't like BTS's music that much. Um, I just find it too high pitched. I don't like pop music. I don't. Dynamite gets played a lot. I, I just hate that. I, I don't know. So they did this. And it's actually kind of different. So the Travis, I think was the Travis Scott one. Was it? One of them had like a McFur, McFlurry instead of the drink. Which. I have no idea. It's not really an option that, that restaurants give you that you can put like a shake and fries together as a combo. Though it should be. I think like I think maybe Sonic and maybe Steak and Shake are like the only two I, maybe maybe Shake Shack. I think Shake Shack's one of them. But there's one thing I do want to talk about is the lack of branding on the on, on this meal. So here's the bag. 
Oh, it's kind of there. Here's the bag. It says McDonald's. And then I assume that's the BTS logo. That when, I guess when BTS got announced, at least for this meal, they did it with fries, which is kind of genius. Um... I don't know, just kind of genius. So, I guess there's a little branding. I guess I'm wrong. I really like that. I really didn't pay too much attention to the bag. It's a nice purple. I like purple. Uh, and it comes with two sauces they can get. You got occasion. And you have sweet chili. Oh, also come with chicken nuggets and a Coke. So. And it just hit me while I'm recording this. Why doesn't... Uh oh. Why doesn't uh, McDonald's have like an exclusive Coke or like an exclusive Mountain Dew? Or like exclusive Pepsi? Like with uh, the man Pepsi Mango? Why didn't McDonald's jump on that being like, hey, make it exclusive for us? Pepsi doesn't do that many exclusives when it comes to stores. Well, no, they do, because they own Mountain Dew, so Mountain Dew. So strange. Don't know why I didn't say this before. But. The sauces work really well as well. They're unique enough. I think people are going to like them, and maybe they'll sell them. Like the Szechuan sauce from uh, Rick and Morty. I know that was a whole issue. But they're good. They're nice. They're really great. You get them with your fries or your chicken. It works very well. Very complimentary. And we got the Cajun, which looks a lot like honey mustard. I never liked honey mustard. It's like a nice spicy um, Thousand Island. That's pretty good. Got the... Uh, Sweet chili. Okay. I like that. But, um, I'm kind of not talking, trying the food. I'm kind of just talking. I mean, I'm, I tried the new sauces. It's about what's all that's really new. But there's nothing really with it. There isn't, like, a collector's card you could get. Like, with, oh, if there were collector cards. You guys remember the Pokemon thing? I made that video. You can go check it out. Like how what, what went up with the uh, the um, the Pokemon cards? Like that was hilarious. Just watching that dumpster fire just burn everything. Like it was hilarious. But well, kind of not because how much people were wasting. But I don't know. It was just one thing after another. Chicken's chicken. I like the chicken with the sweet chili sauce. I'm not a big fan of Cajun. I did a Wingstop video. It should be coming out in like several weeks. And I think it works. I think it actually works this time. I think they actually got it. I don't think it worked well enough with Jay Baldwin or Travis Scott as they're more uh, popular in their area. Um, J Balvin, I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly, he is from Cuba or, Ar no, it's, it's Argentina, I think. Oh, Flushing Canada. And, uh, Travis Scott was, was like, that's one I never heard of, but he's an American rapper, I think. Or he's British as, you know, his name's Travis Scott. It just sounds like a British name. But I think this one works. And what's another one they could do? There'll be a Twitter poll. Yeah, what other um, weird musician meals could they do? I think put on there uh, the Metallica meal. If they do Metallica, you have to call it the Metallica meal. If you don't, it doesn't work. Then Kiss, Kiss will do it. They got 
face on everything. Heck, they did Crossroads Scooby Doo twice. Heck, they did with Archie Andrews. And then. Just for jokes, a Burger King McDonald's crossover. If they decided to do that, like how funny that would be. But yeah, I think this is a success. I think the BTS meal works. He gets across um, what it needs to do. It. Is this thing that people really like? Two things people really like, so I think it'll work. And it also works. Is you guys like commenting and subscribing on videos? It really helps out the algorithm. It shows what you guys like more, and I'll try to do more of those videos. It gives me joy. I get to see you know what people like, and just you know talking with you guys. Uh, check out my website. Links are all in the description. Check out my socials. I'll link for a Twitter. I don't know. What tw I'm kind of having trouble with the Twitter account. They got like blocked, so I have to get that all figured out. I don't know what the issue was. Maybe we're not posting for. I don't know what the heck it was, but stuff. It'll be fixed. There'll be a link down there. And uh, I'll see you later. Peace.